Hey everyone, welcome back to another video on my gaming. Today on Dead by Daylight, I'm playing as Nia, and we have a bit of a ninja build, so I'm going to be using Quick and Quiet and Iron Will to try to be a ninja, so the killer can lose us easily in a chase. And I also have Dead Heart just in case we get hit and we need a quick getaway. And we have Plunderers because I have a quest to take items out with me. So that's why I brought Plunderers and I will be looking through as many chests as I can. And I'm now cleansing totems because in the past few games I have gotten quite a few Noad gamers. So we are doing totems just in case. And now we have done one totem and we're just going to hop on this generator. So the killer we are going against is Oni, and as you can see, he has already downed one of my teammates. So yeah, this is one of my first few games since a long time for me to be back on Dead by Daylight PC because I have been playing a lot of other games and I've also been playing Dead by Daylight Mobile. So. I really haven't been playing PC version for a very long time and this killer we're going against is not very good because of rank reset anyway so we're back to a really low rank. So as we saw the Oni was going towards my generator so I ran across the map to save this Claudette which went down pretty early and now he's after one of my other teammates who completed the other generator. So now I'm just running back to my gen, but it's actually pretty near to where the teammate got down. So now I'm just repairing right in front of him and I thought, well, maybe that's not a good idea. So I ran away and you can see that my teammate already used up the pallet here and I don't really have anything to loop. So I thought, mm, maybe I can make a quick and quiet play, you know. And I'm just looping around this area and waiting for the Oni to catch up with me. And later you can see that this killer is really not very good. But okay, I got stuck here as you can see, so I gave him a free hit. But I went in for the save because I knew that the Oni would hit the person who just got off the hook. And they have a bit of immunity before they will get downed after just getting saved. So now the Oni is going after me, which is a good idea. So I used that heart to get to this window and I used quick and quiet so that the Oni would be very confused as to why there were no audio when I was just vaulting that window. And luckily he didn't hit me. Yeah, and I just ran straight into this building. And because I have Iron Will, he was probably very confused and he was still around that area. So the Nia healed me up and I searched another chest because as I've mentioned, I have a quest. So now I have opened two chests and I'm back on another generator. So this Claudette is clearly a newish player because they weren't really doing much. They were hiding in lockers all the time. And later during her chase, she also goes down pretty quickly. So you just saw how easily we lost the killer. So yeah, she shouldn't have gone down that quickly, in my opinion anyway, but maybe she wasn't used to the Oni's power. Anyway, we're now just going to do another generator. We still have three to go, and as you saw, we did half of one generator, and we did another complete generator, and we still have three left. So you must be wondering what my teammates are doing, right? Anyway, I'm just cleansing another totem because, again, as I said, I want to avoid no ed. And I've already done a lot of the objectives. So now I'm just running towards this place because I know there is a relatively unsafe generator here. So the killer, if he goes towards me, I can loop him for a bit. And then my teammates, who can't seem to last a long time in a chase, can do generators. 
but the Oni went towards me as expected and I just hit here and he was just using his power to damage the generator and try to hit me I guess. So now he has used up his power so he's back to normal form so I can just loop him around this area without being scared of a one hit down. And as you can see, we just looped that place once and we ran straight to the building again and he lost us again. So I was okay and then I just ran out of this exit and then he was right in front of us. So yeah, that was really funny. And then I just ran back to the gen and I completed it. And my teammates have finally done another gen as well. So that is a good idea. That is really great. I'm very glad they weren't just sitting in a locker anymore. So yeah, we are back on the gen which has zero progress because he kicked it. And we're just a gen jockey now. So you can see that he is going towards me again. And now we have done half of the gen. So I used quick and quiet here to hop into the locker and try to joke him because I didn't feel like running all the way to the building again and he has his power up so he can actually just run straight towards me if I run to the building and then he can one hit down me so that's why I hid in the locker and I guess he didn't expect it because he looked towards the locker but he didn't check it so once he left my area I just exited the locker quietly and then I went back on my gen and completed it while the Oni must have found one of my other teammates. So it's either the Claudette or the Nia. And my guess was the Claudette because the Nia is also a better player than the Claudette in my opinion. So I did the gen finally and we have one left. So I ran towards this area because I knew there was a gen near this place but I also didn't know what perks the Oni had and I thought he might have barbecue and chili so that's why I ran towards this direction for five seconds and then I hid in this locker for a slight bit so that if he heads towards the other direction that I ran to he wouldn't be able to find me and then I just exited the locker and I ran to the gen which got kicked so it meant that someone was working on this gen before me and I think it was the Claudette. So now we've done nearly half of the gen and as you can see someone is on the hook and we're just repairing. The Oni left the hook and ran towards this area and I just got into this locker and for some reason he didn't see me. So I was like what is happening and I just went back on the gen like obviously Nia is a ninja but still I didn't expect him not to see me at all and my teammates went down to this Oni so we completed the gen and we escaped with the other Nia so hopefully you enjoyed watching this video please leave a like if you did and subscribe to the channel if you want to and I will try to do more Dead by Daylight videos for you in the future bye